Good, Anna. Good job, nice. Back in. Turn. Very nice. Excellent. Excellent. Very nice. Big turn on the back end, shoulder turn it. And match point right here, give me a rip. Anna, you're doing so great, you're getting a lot better. So what's your training regimen now? Like you play, we play once a week? Do you... um, no, oh, we play once a right. week. Right, and then what else do you do and besides that? And I play with some other people. Okay, great. Yeah, that's I great. Like that. But you know what Everybody else? Everybody's so different. And, uh, different opponents, you get different like yeah. type of uh, shots coming at you. Yeah. That's great. And you do singles, right? Yeah, yeah. Awesome. And you still do the clinic as well, right? Um, no, I haven't done clinic since they had this uh, competition in February. I don't know. Like what competition? Out, I think they had something. Oh, like a tournament? <laughs> yes. Oh, you didn't join? No, I didn't. Okay, you're not quite since ready yet. then, I didn't go. I don't know why. All right, that's down, the, down, the, down the road, you're going to start competing too. Oh, yeah. Start playing some matches, yeah. yeah. But you don't know, even know how to, do you know how to keep score? We never did even... Don't ask me. No, I don't. I got to teach you that. Okay. I got to teach you how to keep score, like 15 love, 30 love and all that. Mm -hmm. And are you practicing your serve? You're not? You have to, Anna, because you can't play matches I without know, having a serve. The that. serve is super important. Yeah. You know what's also For great? Because sure. yeah. we have so many videos now. You can also review the videos. Do you ever do I'm that? I'm always reviewing the videos. I love you watch that, that because, like, I during the lesson there is a reactive mode and stuff. Yeah. But then you sit down and you're like, yeah, watching. You can the review video and you go into it. And I have a lot Absolutely. of aha moments because I'm just watching the video. Right. And you probably like yeah. what it is the thing in a lesson. Sometimes I tell you so many things you forget, Absolutely. but you have it on, on on video. You can always review it. Constantly. Do you ever read the comments? Uh, sometimes I sometimes see the comments. So the comments are, I've got to tell you, out of all the comments I get, the comments on the your videos are the best. Oh, yeah? Yeah, i got to read you some. Yeah. Okay, so this guy says, the majority of experienced players has worse strokes than she had after this introduction. This was on our first video, the oh, beginner oh, video that we made. Yeah. So this is really oh, something amazing. Epic video. <laughs> no, that was an amazing video because you did so well right away. Thank you. You picked it up super fast. Yeah, I, I fell in love with the game right away. Right away, right? <laughs> This it's is just something yeah, you like it. After dancing is my next favorite. This thing. your second passion. Yeah. Very very nice. Sure. What's in the bushes <laughs> I here? Don't know. You hear that? She's going crazy. What some is paparazzi. it? What is because it? Some paparazzi are following us. You heard that, right? Oh yes. Somebody's jumping. Okay, Anna. This guy I'm says she has a very very nice personality. This guy likes your personality. I I've heard that a lot. You know. I, I love very nice. live. You know. I just I like. Very to, nice. To have fun. Okay, let's see here. Le okay, this guy says it would be really interesting if you could show her progress in three months, six months, etc. Oh. So this is actually something that's amazing. I always wanted to have this opportunity to have someone who I'm teaching like from scratch, but have it on video. Because I love teaching beginners. It's one of my favorite things to do because I can literally like teach them from scratch, from the beginning. And then you can see the progress of, of how are they improving but I never had the opportunity to tape it from day one and then down the road and have it on video footage. So it's definitely something that uh, we should do. Like continue to record. No pressure. And, and <laughs> then like maybe two years from now, see how good you've gotten and then have the comparisons, you know, from the beginner stage um, yeah. to when you get more no advanced. Pressure, no pressure. Okay, this guy says, beautiful form. Please feature her every week. Oh. Well, actually, you know, as I already told you, we decided to take a little bit of a break from recording because we don't want it to ever get repetitive. We want to keep it fresh and exciting. Yeah. And we don't want to go over the same lessons like twice. We don't have an, want to have repetitive sessions. So we had pretty much all the strokes. Yeah. And now we're going to take a little bit of a break, like um, maybe two, three months and see how you're progressing then. Sure. Record again and have like a progress report, you know? It's going to be There's, hot in Florida. Woo. It's going to be super hot then yeah, in the summer. Yeah, we started when it was hot. Like when well, it was September, I think, right? What month was it? I don't remember. I think it was August maybe. August. We so how many months, months have we been working already? Five, five months? months ago. Five months. Mm -hmm. This hasn't been that hasn't been that long. Yeah. This guy asks, is it possible to follow Anna on a social network? Oh, is it yes, possible? Yes, of course. What is it? Follow me everybody. You know? But what is it? Tell <laughs> tell people. It's A N N A R O G E R S seven. 
Anna so Rogers Anna seven. Rogers 7. That's I mean, Instagram. Yeah. What about TikTok? You still doing TikTok? Oh uh, no, I had uh, my. But you haven't deleted it. Sure. No, I have not deleted it. So what's your TikTok? TikTok? I forgot. I think it's Anna V one nine seven five. Anna V Anna V one nine seven five. Okay, okay. Yeah. So everybody, go Anna follow Anna. follow Anna on the social I might network. I go back to it. You know, you never know. Good, good. How did she repay you for this private lesson? Oh. <laughs> What is this? I read this one. You read this one? I don't know. Only you know. Well, <laughs> I'll get into that in a minute. We we do have an agreement. Are you sure you want we, to? We have an a, a, agreement. Are you sure? Arrangement. Oh, no. Don't we have an that. arrangement. <laughs> now, I'm going to tell. I'm going to tell, but I'm going to respond to it uh, from, a, from a specific question. Okay, this is interesting. This guy says it's so obvious that she plays golf. The follow-through and how she moves the other leg and her foot after the stroke. No, You're a golf player? No, no, no. I've tried it twice. Yeah? Yeah recently actually okay also like it. after it's really we after our beginner session oh, or yeah yeah that was a couple months ago i've tried oh okay mm -hmm. no i so enjoyed it it's really but you you haven't played golf before no no okay Never. okay anna this is very interesting um lol she is not a beginner it is staged taught over 10k hours of lessons she's trying to look like a beginner oh that's a big compliment seriously but i'm a stage he, person that's for sure i like to you know were you are you lying to me all along no? You never played before? No. That was our first session right. when we recorded that epic video. Yes. I've never, I've never played in my life. Yeah, that's why when I fed you balls, you were hitting everything on, with two hands on both sides. Yeah. Out of all the beginners that I ever taught, I think you progressed the fastest. That's why I don't blame people who think this is staged and fake mm -hmm. because it's quite amazing how, how much how you picked it up immediately in that first session you started hitting balls over the net and started cleaning up your technique because I can tell you that some of the other beginners that I teach they have a very difficult time connecting with the ball they can't even mm -hmm. connect uh, with the with the strings and the ball together you know yeah I feel like the animal so, is coming out of me when the ball is coming yeah like, like it's very natural it's very like natural for leopard, you know, just <laughs> okay. but um yeah so you you were like you learned it very very quickly you picked it up very quickly so I understand that people think uh, it was staged, but it was definitely not. Um, you were an absolutely 100% complete beginner uh, before that first lesson. Who's agree with me that she's Russian? Anna, <laughs> what's, what, will you reveal your nationality? Yes, I'm from Russia. You're from Russia. Yes. Okay, all right, this guy. From Siberia, from the coldest part. And nice. I live in here in paradise. You know what's funny? You know who else is from Siberia? Sharapova. Sharapova, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. this must be this tennis hotspot. A lot of great yes, tennis so. players from there. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Totally unfair comment. This guy qualifies it right away. But Anna seems to be more interested in the opportunity to have a bunch of new skimpy outfits than anything else. <laughs> okay. No, the thing is, like, I honestly didn't have time to invest into clothes for tennis yet. Exactly. I just think it's not my number one priority. Right. Whatever skimpy I have home, I wear. Right. You don't have, you didn't, especially that first lesson, you didn't have any uh, I, tennis I still clothes. Don't. This is Lululemon, but I don't think it's for, uh, for tennis. There's right? nothing. That's ridiculous. Don't even I'll don't look listen. Into it. I'll look don't listen to that. I'll look into don't listen to that. If people don't realize it's very warm here. I mean, like, I don't know how else to dress, but lightly. Yeah. You got to dress lightly. Exactly. It's 90 degrees out. Anna, this guy says, I can almost see her brain grow new connections second by second. She is so smart. I Somebody agree. You notice my brain. Yes, very sometimes smart. Sometimes it comes handy. Sometimes really, yes. I'm overthinking the stroke. And the well, this is on your forehand. That's what happened. Yes. See, a lot of people were wondering uh, what I'm doing with your forehand, and they were telling me also what to do on your forehand. Oh yeah. But I, have, through my experience, I made the decision to go back to your old forehand, mm -hmm. like we talked about, because we're going to develop that loop a little bit slower than I normally would I, with other people because your interpretation of the loop was a little bit uh, too mechanical yeah. so you were obsessing on the loop it was too much in your head like you said you were thinking about it too much mm -hmm. and it made the forehand very robotic and mechanical it didn't look smooth anymore yeah. and you weren't getting it in you were missing it a lot when you were playing with me you told me your forehand was not working at all in the clinics and that's why I made the decision to to slow down on the loop you know For to sure. just build it gradually step by step and your forehand came back. I think it's been pretty good lately, right? It's getting better. It's getting better. Ballroom dancer, she's light on her feet. Definitely helps a female fetterer. That's a very nice comment. Oh, yeah? So let's just tell the audience, you do ballroom dance. Yeah, I love dancing. 
Right, you did competitions and stuff, right? I did competitions, I performed, um, and I love going social dancing. This is like most fun. This is cardio. That's great. Yeah. And what yeah. I find with uh, ballroom dancers is the weirdest thing. I've was te I'm teaching actually two other people that do ballroom dance, mm -hmm. and one of them you met. Remember that? Yes, yes. And um, everyone that does ballroom dance is in unbelievable shape. Like they don't have an ounce of fat on them, so it must be in the most amazing workout ever, ballroom it really dance. Is. Yeah. I'm waiting for you to start. Oh, oops. Wait. <laughs> That's we're gonna reveal that okay. later. Okay, this is an interesting comment. She's already athletic. This coach is amazing. The ability to bring out the best in an athlete is a great skill. She will be on a women's 3.5 team in no time if she keeps this up. Then when she falls in love with the game, I don't see why she won't be a solid 4.0 player. Mm -hmm. So you know what those numbers mean? No. There's like the rating system and it's the, um, let's say 5.0 is like the highest you can get as a recreational player. Nice. And right now I would rate you as a 3.0. Mm -hmm. You think so? I think so. Okay, because I think people so. ask me at the clinic. Yeah. And they said, ask your coach. So 3.0. I know. 3.0. 3.0. I think we're going to be 3.5 in a few months. Okay. And then probably next year we're going to be 4.0. Like uh, improvement in tennis, it's very gradual. Like you can't just jump these levels fast. Of course. You have to yeah, be yeah. patient. But I think, I think this, this um, person says 4.0. I actually think you can be 5.0. I think so. But it's going to take a long time. I'm glad so you believe yeah. me. Yeah. It's going to take a lot of rep like training. You're going to have Repetition. to play as much as possible. Muscle memory. Muscle memory, you're going to have to start playing matches. You're going to have to learn how to keep score and all that stuff. And um, I don't see any reason why you shouldn't get up to the highest recreational level. This is interesting. What a great video. I watched the whole thing with no intention of playing tennis whatsoever. <laughs> <laughs> you see, this guy, uh, a uh, lot of people. It serves uh, yeah. d different purposes. But, um, you know, my goal is to get people to play tennis. And one thing I do like, I get a lot of beginners to watch me and they start playing tennis and they, and, and they write me and they say, I started play, playing tennis because of you. Uh, I love it, but this guy has no intention of playing and still had a fun time watching the video. So that's good too, I guess. But my, <laughs> main, but my main goal, I do want people, I want to grow the sport, you know? Yeah, yeah. I love this game. Like the one, uh, I don't know if you found it. No. Uh, it's a late uh, comment. I was just watching uh, the video mm -hmm. and somebody said, the guy looks like Tom Brady. I know, I saw that. I don't <laughs> That's see... That's a good one, you know? I don't see that at all. Tom Brady? Yeah, I see that a no. little bit. No. Yeah. No, not Again, even Again, maybe like the way you, you squint your face. I do have a lot. Yeah, well, if, yeah, yeah. You need a Botox, you know? <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to pass on that, okay? I don't think I'm going to do that. Here it is. This guy writes, maybe a next video is of you getting a lesson in ballroom dancing. Uh-huh. Here we go. We okay, got so into now, it. so now we can explain the entire arrangement between Anna and I. So, I'm teaching you tennis, and in return, you are going to teach me ballroom dancing. Mm -hmm. And while you are one of the most gifted beginner tennis players I've ever seen, I am one of the least gifted dancers probably you've ever seen. So you actually have the the hard challenge of trying to teach me. Not true. It's <laughs> very true. It's very true. No, no, no. I taught him some basic lessons. Basic already. lessons, yes. I did. You did great. Yes. Of course. I'm trying. You but that's body it. weight transfer. It's not my like strength. Awareness. You but I do see already, like, you just never have time. I don't have time, but okay. I do see some improvements already in my posture from dancing. That's yes. one of the takeaways. Every dancer that I meet, they have the most amazing posture ever, yes. and so do you. And maybe that's something that I can learn from dancing because my posture has always been uh, not the greatest. So. Well, you are like a walking noodle. So speaking of dancing, do you wanna do you wanna do our lesson that we normally do? Do you wanna do a dan dance lesson real quick? Yeah. All right. Okay, All right. Let's, let's do go. It. Okay. Let's do it. <laughs> okay. So which one are we doing today? We are learning bachata. Okay. All right. Bachata is like eight counts. It's very. Yeah, I think we can back up a little bit. Very cool music. You know, anything goes. So yeah. It's one, two, three, four, five. What six, kind of music seven, is it? Eight. I'm sorry, I interrupted the teacher, oh, but we should turn on the music then. Bob, the I'm music? gonna get copyright strike. So just tell me, um, we'll turn on the music um, in our oh, heads. Let me turn it off. We can't. I'm gonna get copyright strike. Oh, that's right. Uh, the music could be anything that yeah? is going like this. If you're sitting and you're doing this with your leg okay. in the bar, okay. that means it's bachata. It's very like, like this? easy. Yes. Yeah, so okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Got one, it. Two, okay. Three. Tap. One, two, three, tap. Tap means you're not putting body weight on it. So, so you go, okay. one, All right. two, 
three, tap, one, two, three, tap. So okay. wait, 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 and then tap. And then tap? Yes, let's All do right. it. Are you ready? I'm ready. So okay. which, one, which way are we going? This way or that way? We are going this way. We are All facing right. each other. All right. And we are doing this. Okay, okay. let's go. All right, ready? Go. go.